Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I will be teaching you guys the most requested balloon design that I've been got so far. And it's my hot air balloons! I have a lot of email requesting whether I am teaching my hot air balloon. For the hot air balloon, I will be splitting into three parts. The part one, I will be teaching you guys how to do the hot air balloon basket. Part 2, I will be teaching you guys how to do the hot air balloon at the top And part 3, I will teach you how to assemble everything on the spot Hot air balloon part 1 I will be teaching you guys how to do the hot air balloon basket And as you can see, this balloon is slightly fatter than the normal one We are using 360 so it is slightly fatter than the regular one we use for our regular balloon sculpting. As you can see, okay. So for people who are using Qualitex, it will be slightly shorter than usual because the balloon I'm using is Simplex. It is much longer than Qualitex. So it saved me a lot of time and a lot of balloons. But if you are living in Singapore, you can contact me. I can let you know where is the company who sells in the next. And without further ado, we shall get into sculpting. For the balloon basket, we will need 22360 brown and 7260 brown. First part, we will be using 360 brown. Pamela. Make sure you pump it full, leaving about one finger at the back. Pump another one. After you come up, tie them together. Just like that. Okay, right now we're gonna use our four fingers to measure the two. Do your own length, don't have to follow me. So, usually my length is about this size. Okay, and we move on to the second balloon. Do the same thing using our four finger one, two, three, and fix it. After you're done, connect these two together. After that, swap one of the balloons through the middle, like this. Okay, to prevent this part opening up. Okay, so keep on, continue, repeat the same thing. One, two, three. So this is one of it, two of it, we are going to do six. So just continue. So after doing finish the first one, we're going to do five more because we need six of it. Just the same as this. Six of this, we are going to move on to do another five but in different design. So, right now, I'm gonna teach you pump up two balloons. Same 
everything, tie them together. Just like that. And instead of doing four finger three times, you're gonna do two fingers, but And your second finger will be half, just like that. Okay? So basically, by right, you're using like 12 fingers. Okay, for 8, 12, 12 fingers. So right now, you're only gonna use 6 fingers. Just like that. 6 fingers. We have something like this. Okay? Do the same thing for the other balloon. Okay? And First, this part you're not gonna twist them together because they will somehow pop out. Pop out. Okay, so we move on to do 12 fingers again, like this, for this, and switch to another balloon. 12 fingers. Okay, once you have something like this, you're gonna twist the long balloon, the long one, together. Just like this. Okay, continue the same thing. Twelve fingers. Okay, this, this, turn it. Once you have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, don't count the small one, okay? You have 5 of it. Right at the ending, you will need another small one. So, 6 fingers and 6 fingers. Just like this. You should get something. The reason why I tell you not to twist this part is you'll somehow just pop out itself. So just leave it for the moment and continue to do five of them again. After you're done, after you have done this for five times, okay. Right now we're gonna move on. Come up, our 260 brown to about this length. Okay, come up all the seven 260 brown to the same size. After you have pump up all the seven balloons, just leave it aside for a while. Gonna use them shortly and pick up this. Okay, don't have the small bubbles, man. Okay, pick up one of this. Okay, and pick up one two sixty brown. Tie it at the edge like this. Gonna do one bubble like this and do one big shape like this. Something like that. Okay. And next, we are going to take another 260. Gonna tie it here. Make sure you secure everything to be tight. Attach the next one here. Make sure it's tight. And now we are gonna take another 260, tie it here. Another 260, tie it here. Okay. And take another 
sexy. I did here. Now, take the last 260, this, and tie it here. After, once you tie it up, the one bubble and one pinch twist. Here, right? So you just have to push it down like this. Okay? For the third balloon here, for the third balloon here, you're gonna take the third balloon, pull it in, like that, like this, okay? And for the fourth balloon, you're gonna do the same thing as the third one, you're gonna slot it in. Okay, for the fifth balloon, you do the same thing. Continue until the seventh balloon. Six, E. Okay, and the last one, you're gonna do exactly the same as the first one. So you're gonna do one bubble. Two bubbles, just like that. Okay, and the second bubble will be a big piece. Like this. Okay, and connect to the big piece. Make sure everything is tight. Okay, just like that. Finish, you should have. Gonna continue the third one. The third one, we're gonna take this one without a small bu small bubble at the side. Okay? So we'll keep alternating the full one, and then the half one, then the full one, and then the half one. The third one, we're gonna attach it. Okay? So this one you're, you're not gonna slot it in. But you're gonna place it in. So for the second balloon here, this is the first and this is the second. You're gonna do one twist like this. Leave a bit of inches here. Okay. And slot it in between here. Okay, so you're gonna slot in, twist it. Like this. Okay, move on to the third one. We'll do one bubble and slot it in. 
you know secure it and you have your 